What's up guys? Today we're watching season 4 episode 6 of Breaking Bad. So last episode was more than a bit I guess you can say. Cause you know we had Jesse who was going on some like money pickup runs with Mike. You know having some adventures. Walter was you know talking to Hank. <laughs> I swear the amount of shit that happened last episode. But yeah what's it called? Jesse was hanging out with Mike going on runs and you know the last run ended up being like a fucking thing where Jesse had to like hit him with their car dip and everything but that turned out to be a whole plan from like Gus and Mike and I wouldn't have guessed that but and not only that Hank was getting off the case of like Gail he was getting off Gail's case and then you know what Walter did? Walter drank and then he opened his mouth trying to say that Gail wasn't a genius and like his dude is probably still out there and you know what Hank's now back on the case so Walter did that to himself he did that to him and Jesse so if they get caught I'm blaming it on Walter and yeah I want to see what's just gonna happen this episode so I guess let's just get into it So we got two dudes traveling with the shit this time, and it's not Mike. No, 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 no. We're going through the same process again, man. So they're going to be dead on the inside, so they don't even have to shoot. I guess they they locking them in there. Okay. So they dead. Who's stealing the product? I did not want to see that. They really snacking while they wait for these men to die. We're just lucky, what's his name? Mike isn't there. Well, so now they got the product. And what is Gus gonna do? Cause we don't even know who these people are. We just know they stealing. Are you telling me you're only grabbing one bucket? All of that for one bucket. I just wanted to say that I was thinking about you and the kids and uh, I love you. Why do you keep re-listening to it? Does she sense like a tone of voice thing or something? Really? Jesus. You shouldn't have let me sleep. You needed it. Oh wait, yeah, because of last night. Okay. So she senses something maybe, which is why she was re listening to it. And Gail was on the computer. I've said some things. That... Did you know this Gail about a person? What did I say? She was gonna question if he knew Gail. Did you work together? <sighs> Who killed him? Jesse. Was it somebody who, at some point, might want to do the same to you? 
No. Well, I think you're scared. Mm. I think that message was some kind of goodbye. No. It kind of seemed like that, so I think you're right. Cry for help. I think some part of you wants Hank to catch you. Wow. Is that true, though? It's like, I feel like that's kind of true. Us, stop trying to justify this whole thing and admit you're in danger. Who are you talking to right now? What the fuck do you mean? Stop going into work. A business big enough that it could be listed on the NASDAQ goes belly up. Disappears. It ceases to exist. I am not in danger, Skylar. I am the danger. A guy opens his door and gets shot and you think that of me? No. I am the one who knocks. Um... That was scary. But it's like, why do you have to let her know that? You know, it's like, hmm, I don't even know how to describe it. It's like you have to prove that it's you. And like you did to her, but I don't know. Look, I was... She gone, Betty. But where has she gone? Next thing you know, she shows up with a cop at the door. Or maybe she went to Marie's. Yes, I understand. Good. Good. I don't want her coming back with more demands. She, she gave me hard time when we settled on price. <laughs> takes hard work. You've seen me work hard, Bogdan. Yeah? Mm, I don't know. Not so much, maybe. Huh? Um... He's the boss right now. Why are you talk- Why are you talking to him like that? Leave him be. He didn't ask for a lesson. Even if they don't want to. Can you be tough, Walter? I think you can be. And if not, you can always call your wife. Huh? Don't say that to a man who is already, like, he has a pride problem. Who'd have thought that someday I would be handing these keys to you? No one, because he hasn't been there since season one. Bogdan. As is. He was going to take the dollar and he wants to keep it. I kind of feel bad like he doesn't seem like a bad dude because he was just running a business but like I don't know I just feel bad that Walter's like that with him why I thought you were just gonna put it back on the wall You're like a petty kind of man too. You and Skyler are kind of alike. You'd be shaking a bit, my, du my dude. Do you need rest or something? 
even Mike is noticing. You okay there? Fine. <laughs> Look at Mike being nice. Oh wait, is he going through withdrawals? Since he hasn't been using? You need any help? No. So he's just leaving Jesse there? How's Jesse supposed to get home? Cause I thought he rode with him, you know? Exactly. Just, you know, she asked if I was okay and not to worry, like that. So she still hasn't came home. It's not, not at all. Yes, it is. I, I read online, she's not even allowed to be mad at you. And she can't be mad at you about the cancer, can she? Huh. Now I just feel bad because it's like they told them the truth, but it's still not even the truth. Hmm, he's trying to justify it. School can wait. Why don't we take a little detour? What kind of detour? Yeah, where are we going? Pulls up to a house and it's like, bam, new house and it's cool as fuck. I think... It's time we got you your own car. What do you think? No way. I thought it was going to be a house. He bought him the Challenger. That is amazing. So you're here. Yeah. Where else are you gonna be? Oh, I guess with Mike. What? That's what you said. I said I guarded him. Like backup. Like a second set of eyes. Everybody needs backup, right? So like a bodyguard and a way. Muscle heads that Gus has working for him? It has to be Jesse Pinkman. Why? What, is there something about you that I don't know? See, he's kind of like right about questioning it because, you know... I saved Mike from getting robbed. Even killed, maybe. So maybe I'm not such a loser after all. At least their plan is working, but still, you know... It wasn't even real. I mean, think about it. Your first day out guarding Mike, he steps out for one second, and what happens? You immediately get robbed. How would you even guess that? Me, and he hates the fact that he needs me. So what does he do? He goes to work driving a wedge between you and me. You're an asshole. If you'd been there, you know it wasn't a setup. Wait a minute. I just feel bad that Jesse doesn't know, cause. It was a setup. No, no, this, this whole thing, all of this, it's all about me. He thinks everything is about him, bro. Like, a lot of shit is about him, but I don't know. He just, he's kind of like pissing me off again. When is he not pissing me off? Is someone getting called up to Gus's office or something? Yeah. I'll be right up. So he's not working. What? Am I supposed to clean all this on my own? At that point, it, like in a way, I do kind of get where Walt is coming from. Like they're taking his partner that he needs 
and leaving him to do all that shit on his own. Like, what do you expect man to do? He needs his partner to help him. Uh, no, 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 it, it, it's bueno. Um, uh, uh, por favor, por favor, entra, entra, si. Muy bueno, muy bueno. What else is he supposed to do? He needs help. No. Por usted, no? Si, si, si. Para usted, si. Para usted. This one for you. Yeah, see, si. see. Si. President A. Grant, very important man. <laughs> A very important man. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if someone's gonna like tell him something about it. Like they really can't if they expect that man to do it all on his own. Where are you be going? You've been gone for like a day or two already. And you're gonna pull up to your house and there's a new car. I'm so confused. I don't know what the US Department of Interior is. It does say interior, right? What does that mean? What for? Now, a little birdie told me there's some guys in there that have three pounds of our product, which they're selling, and which they sure as hell didn't get from us. The dudes from the beginning of the episode. The bucket. Our property back. Why don't you just go break the door down just to whip those bitches and show them who's boss? You start a fight that way. Now, what you may not know about meth heads, maybe you do, they're kind of unpredictable. <laughs> Mike, come on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? Maybe I'm looking to buy. Does he have a smart plan here? Mother out. Taco, will you shut the damn door? We're gonna tell the strangers. Taco! Get off the porch, asshole. Taco, will you shut the door? All right, already, G Yeah, they don't shut the hell up. Guess we'll go with plan A then. <laughs> Pop the trunk, would you? Why? There's something in there I need. And what would. What are you gonna do, bro? In such a wild success. You may know this whole PI sit in the car business, but I know meth heads. It might not be a good thing, but at least he knows about it. Not the camera angle, bro. But exactly what is he gonna do with that shovel? How deep are you going? I don't know. How deep do you think it is? What do you mean? Yeah. Mind if I use your John? <laughs> so he's gonna walk into that house without anyone else knowing. Look at Mike smiling. And that place is a wreck. I'm a friend of Tucker's. What do you want? I just, uh, just wanna, just wanna buy some of the blue. It's not for sale. He's scary, okay. Yeah, I get it. Okay, I don't wanna, 
I don't want to start any trouble. Trouble? Trouble? What's that mean? Trouble? No, no, no. I'm, I'm just saying. Oh my god. I am kind of terrified for him. Tucker! <gasps> As you should. Oh! Hey, Mike. Residar cerca, aquí. Sí, ¿por qué quiere venir con nosotros? I missed that one. I'm sure it was good. Damas, vengan conmigo. I don't know why I was expecting Gus. This was my idea. Don't punish them. You tell Gus to blame me, not them. He does. And he's still sending them back. That's fucked up. Give us a minute, will you? Gus shows up with him around, but not Walter. About their message, what's the answer? Set up a meeting. Let's see what they have to say. How are you supposed to contact them? I hear you can handle yourself. I guess. Good night. That's all you gotta say? Why me? I like to think I see things in people. What did I say? <sighs> so, did you see what's in the driveway? Uh, yeah, I saw. Pretty hard to miss. I need you to understand that you are safe. You, Junior, Holly, you are completely safe. But she wasn't even completely worried about that. Well, like, yeah, she was, but she's also worried about you, too. Get what he wants. She got a point, it goes though. Back tomorrow. Yeah, he's gonna be mad. But she also has a point. How about the IRS? What? Were you thinking, Walt? I was thinking that I wanted to do something nice for my son. That's just the problem. It's like, you want to be able to do that, but in the situation that you're in, you're kind of being, like she said, too flashy. Once again, he'll blame his bitch mother for taking away what his loving father has given him. So, thanks for that. You know what, Walt? Someone has to protect this family from the man who protects this family. Shit. That's it? Man, barely anything happened this episode. I was expecting more action more something but shit so walter got walter jr a car and now they're gonna have to bring it back and i'm gonna feel bad because just like what skylar said he's gonna be mad at her and that's just gonna be tough on her again so it's like i i give her what was coming from with wanting to do that for his son but maybe it wasn't the best considering like you know they're trying to put on a front so no one really questions them but uh, at least he had it for a day he could have got something way less flashy but also that's not the car that his kid wanted you know it's just sad that he has to bring it back but i mean they have to protect their story you know but What's it called? 
the way that Mike and Jesse were like doing their thing today it's like I like that they work together and they have different skill sets you know not saying that like Jesse's is completely like a good thing since he knew about meth heads since he like was one but you know it helped him in the situation you know they found out who took the shit Mike told Gus and then now they're gonna be setting up a meeting but again I don't know if they said it I don't know who that shit is like who who did it was it like I know there was a dude in the other season that Gus was on the phone with and then sooner or later he got swatted and taken to jail or something like that. Like, I wonder if it's like, has to do with that dude. Like, I'm not totally sure, but I'm just guessing at this point. I just need more information unless I like accidentally didn't even comprehend what they said. But they just have a lot going on. like. And it's so weird to see that Gus goes around Jesse, but he won't go around Walt. It's like, Walt's not really gonna do anything to you. He can't. So, I don't know. It's just a whole big thing. But I'm ready to see what's gonna happen next episode. So, I guess, come back for episode 7. <laughs>